flower arrangement but you don't have the right colors maybe the pink is too pink or blue isn't blue enough or you simply ca cannot find the color you want you could see you could use fabric dye but that always seem like too much work for me and using ink you have more control over where the colors go it is a simple way to dye fake cloth flowers using a water based calligraphy ink supplies the flower you want to dye they need to be lighten lighter than the color that are going to make them white is the best but pastel work fine as uh, well water based calligraphy ink i use blue red and black with a bit of iridescent gloves step 1 preparing the flowers remove flowers from the stem most fake flowers have a center remove it as well don't lose them sometimes the flower are made out of many layers or have different shapes on the outside and inside take care not to get the order mixed it help to take a photo or if you have enough leave one for reference step 2 preparing ink since i want my flower to be deep blue with a pink purple center i am using 3 over 4 tablespoon of blue with 1 and 1/2 tablespoon water and 5 drop of black uh, this was more than enough to dye my two hydrangea heads the recipe i use is based on the ink that i have different types and age of ink will have different ratios so experiment around a, a bit till you have a two color that you want step 3 tying the flower i want my flower to be solid color so i dip the edge of one petal into the ink and use my gloves gloved finger to spread the ink throughout the flower if you want to dye just the edge or center then use your finger or a paint brush to very lightly brush water on the parts you want to dye then dab a tiny tiny amount of a uh, tiny amount on the part that you have just moistened uh, with, with ink a little goes a long long way you can always add more since i want my flower to have pink purple center i added a tiny drop of red to the center the pink flower have a dark darker center that shines through a bit but it wasn't bold enough so i added red to them as well it's best to do this when the base coat is still wet so it will diffuse out evenly step 4 resembling let the flower dry thoroughly or night is best but i just let them dry for 4 hours and they were dry enough to work with make sure the flower look the way you want resemble the flower use the reference photo or the left over flower to make sure that you are you are doing it correctly step 5 finish thank you